Hello everyone, this is the problem asked in GATE 2021 Civil Engineering Set 2. There are few sentences and we have to determine which of the above sentences are grammatically correct. The first sentence is Arun and Aparna are here. The second sentence is Arun and Aparna is here. The third sentence is Arun's family is here and the fourth sentence is Arun's family is here. So to solve this question. Let's have a look at the rules of grammar that we would be requiring. So this is a form of statements or sentences which follows the rules of the subject verb agreement. Now according to the subject verb agreement, the following rules needs to be kept in mind. The first rule is the collective nouns such as group, jury, family, audience, population are usually regarded as a singular objects and the verb used is singular except in some cases. The rule 2 states that a singular subject takes a singular verb whereas a plural subject takes a plural verb. The rule 3 states that whenever a preposition phrase uh, when the preposition phrases separate the subject from the verbs they have no effect on the verbs and the rule 4 states that if the conjunction and is replaced by together with, along with, accompanied by, as well as, then the verb will have no effect for the later part of these expressions. The words prior to these expressions are the subjects. So let's use these rules and try to solve the problem. So let's look at the first and the second statement. The first statement is Arun and Aparna are here and the second statement is Arun and Aparna is here. So the rule that is needed in this set of statement would be a rule number two which states that a singular object takes a singular verb and a plural object takes a plural verb. So in this problem since there are two nouns Arun and Aparna that's why they would take a plural verb that would be R and not a singular verb. So the first statement Arun and Aparna are here is grammatically correct. Now let's have a look at the third and the fourth statement which states that Arun's family is here and the fourth statement which is Arun's family is here. So logically speaking Arun as a noun can only have one family. So logically statement four seems grammatically correct. But let's have a look at the rules of the grammar. Now, now rule one states that collective nouns such as group family, population are usually regarded as singular subjects and the verb mostly used is singular except in some cases. So a collective noun should be followed by a singular verb which is obeyed in sentence 4 which is Arun's family is here. So option 1 and 4 are grammatically correct statements and this matches with option B. So option B 1 and 4 is the right answer. Thank you.